Africa. Omusudi mo Africa. Black sisters, black brothers. Our family continental. Black sisters, black brothers. Our family international. The boundaries are in our minds. The borders are here to convince us. I dare you, do not be confused. They fear us. That's why they tear us. So they won't have to hear us. They fear us. That's why they tear us. So they won't have to hear us. It's about that time united Africa. It's about that time united we stand. Mama Africa, womb so fertile. Mama Africa, womb so fertile. Melanin popping. That's how we relate. Melanin popping. That's how we relate. I have never seen so beautiful a nation. It almost feels as if I was born in a vacation. The black continent is such an ideal destination. It feels so good to be bound to such a destiny, which explains my integrity. Despite the state of my poor continent, my continent is my part. My continent deserves a fair run. Africa, we are the black continent. From the mouth of the black continent, from the mouth of the victims, we say, theoretically speaking, we are a poor nation, so to speak. And yet, if we were to stay fit, we have more diamonds than stones. We could water the oceans full. Our lands could afford more moths than stars. And yet, our greatest goal is hope. Hope for a better tomorrow. Hope that the tech does not work develops our state of mind. Because this, this is a nervous condition. Good people. The mighty tech justice network. You think HIV and AIDS is our biggest problem? This worse than AIDS is our biggest problem. Our lands are not rich for others, a heaven for Western brothers, a hell for our fathers. There is a fancy word for daylight robbery. <laughs> they call it the very indirect investment. Daylight robbery is an understatement. Our poverty trap seems so revised. I wonder if there is a way out. Our poverty trap is a profit for many. I wonder if there is a way out. Our poverty trap is such a creative design. I swear it is a Western design. I wish to swallow my words, to break this tension, but struggle commands my attention. He promises to strangle my sisters tomorrow if I do not speak my truth today. Good people, the Mighty Tech Justice Network, I shall speak. Who I say silence is wicked, who in silence is a prison, a prison that incarcerates the truth, the truth about tomorrow. What is my truth? I have always said for the longest time, I have seen the best flower with wings, that is ordinary. But I have seen the Tech Justice Network fly without wings, that is extraordinary. Tech Justice is indeed worth the celebration. Here we are, building the next generation of Tech Justice champions. Time after time, Tech Justice has stood the test of time. Us, before us, us, after us, now more. The sixth International Tech Justice Academy, this is such a testimony. Tech Justice is indeed worth your celebration. Here we are, building the next generation of Tech Justice champions. Tech Justice is a beautiful thing we have seen. Tech Justice is worthy of a praise we have seen. Viva Tech Justice, viva. Viva Tech Justice, viva. Tech Justice is indeed worth your celebration. Here we are, once upon a time, a wise man once said, Friends and neighbors complain that indeed the taxes are very heavy on us. Those laid on by the government were well, the only ones we had to pay. We might more easily discharge them, but we have many more others, much grievous for some of us. We are surprised by our icons, we tell us much for our pride, for our time as much for our lack of knowledge, lack of understanding. But people, the mighty tensions does not work. Man is not stubborn as a donkey. Man is open minded. Man is open to change. Man can change his mind. The greatest evolution to this is evolution. Man never paid text yesterday. Man pays text today. Man will give up text meeting tomorrow. If man is paid to understand why he pays text. If man sees why he pays text. Thank you.